Hello, I'm Sarah Black. And I'm Theo Black. And here is our review in under three minutes for You Were Never Really Here. No spoilers. Joe, played by Joaquin Phoenix, violently rescues children from sex trafficking, but has some deep emotional issues. That's the movie. That's the movie. This movie didn't work for me. It is an interesting exploration of this theme of the more he hides himself, if he's hidden, is he really there? And there's lots of framing and, and points of plot and story where he's either at the edge of the frame or he's like doing something with people, but is he actually there? And that's kind of an interesting concept to like struggle with and like what does that mean for him? And he's a guy with like some really serious issues from prior events. And I liked all of that. The problem is that it really isn't as psychological as you want it to be. It's mostly just a thriller. Yeah, to me it didn't work either. And it, it is that juxtaposition of kind of a character piece that has the, a mood that isn't quite, but definitely reminds me of things like Little Miss Sunshine, then with a thriller plot that makes me think of Mission Impossible. And they don't mesh for me. And also the insight into his psychology was not deep enough or I guess you would say not specific and detailed enough. There were moments, like it, it, it would show you something that is kind of a detail, but I didn't see the, the continuity of it, how it really affected him, how it had kind of gone through his life. And if you want to do a character piece, I feel like I need that. I feel like this movie suffers from structure issues. If you believe in classical structure, the first 30 minutes of the movie is basically what sets up the last hour, hour and a half of the movie. I think it actually takes about an hour for this movie to set up the last half hour of the movie. So you basically learn all of those things too late. Yeah. It takes too long to get into it. It doesn't really hit what it needs to hit. And then once it's there, it doesn't really explore it long enough. I think it's a structure issue along with what we've already talked about. Yeah, I mean, it might have worked for me if the thriller part were a little different. I don't know. Probably needed to be one or the other. Not, yeah. not this mix of the both that didn't connect. Yeah. If that juxtaposition sounds like something that would interest you, give it a try. For me, it just doesn't quite gel. I think if you like indie films, I would give this one a shot because it's that kind of movie. But be warned, it's not. It's almost a bit more thriller than you'd expect. Theo and I might dissect this a bit more on Twitter. With spoilers. You can find me at Pigeon underscore Sarah. And me at Pigeon underscore Theo. 